This is tutorial number 135, and it covers print settings within CATIA v5. To start off, open up tutorial part number 127, which is included on the DVD. Now what I'm going to do is just go over a few basic print settings, and uh, printing may be a remedial thing, but in CATIA, uh, you might be printing stuff that you don't want, and in the long run, uh, it's going to save you paper, time, and ink. So if you're doing a huge assembly, and if you uh, print the wrong thing, you're going to waste a lot of paper on the plotter, and you're going to waste a lot of ink from the plotter too. So it's going to save you time and money. So let's click File, click Print, and always, always put Best Rotation. It's going to give you the best output. Now with the print area is where uh, problems can occur, and this is what I want to go over. Right now it's selected to the whole document. If you click Preview, you got your whole document, you're happy. If you have it set to display, and if you center this in here, and if you click preview, you're going to be getting this black line all the way around also. Now click OK, and what this is going to do is you're going to have that black edge that's displayed right now all the way around. You don't want that, and like I said, if you're doing a big assembly on a plotter, it's going to waste a whole lot of paper, it's going to waste a lot of ink, you're going to have to throw it out, it's going to waste your time, you're going to have to do it over again. And the last setting is the selection. When you do selection, you're then able to click the select mode, and then just highlight what you want to print. So I'm just going to highlight these guys on the left, click preview, and only those guys are going to be printed. Click OK. So with the print, you're going to have to adjust it to you know, meet your standards, your sizes, whatever it may be. But just knowing, especially the print area, that the display actually displays everything you have there, and it's going to give you that ugly uh, line, that's going to save you a lot of time. Because I'm sure it's happened to everyone that's ever used Katia that you've printed out the wrong thing. You're going to have that uh, big line, thick line on the edge. And if it happens to be on something like a plotter, you're going to lose an entire assembly. Uh, you're going to lose a lot of paper, a lot of ink. So it's just going to save you time, save you a few headaches. And that concludes our tutorial on the print settings within CATIA v5.